¿Dónde está? De elefante. Good afternoon, everyone. Um, just run through normal housekeeping. Um, we'll start with broadcast questions, which Ian will kick us off with. And then after that, we'll do a separate with the dailies, which is embargo till 10.30 tonight. Um, just a reminder, no social media activity during the press conference. Ian, do you want to get us started? Thank you. Hello. Harry Kane. I think that you can see he, uh, he's playing very well. He's scoring goal. Yeah, fantastic for the team. Fant fantastic for him. I'm always that aware. Uh, aware, no? Aware. Always is uh, that trophy represent uh, that the team is uh, is doing well too. And um, yes, happy for him. Happy for the team. Good result in the last few weeks. And I think he's playing well and deserve. Fully deserve that trophy. I mean, he was the Premier League's top scorer <coughs> last season. Has he stepped up a gear? Is he at a, a new level? I think that he's doing very well. After, uh, um, I think he has started to play regular on the on the Premier League uh, um, two years and, and, and a few months ago, and um, and he's showing. Um, that uh, still can improve, but he's showing that he's one of the best uh, strikers in, in Europe and, on, of course, on the Premier League, on England. But he's very young and uh, his mentality is, is try to improve every day and work hard to try to, <coughs> um, to, to, to learn and, and, and be better uh, in every game and every season. You, you never know. It's too difficult to guess. Uh, we hope that more than than that uh, number, but uh, you know, always it's, it's too difficult. Only he needs to be focused, work hard, and and try to to be patient, play, uh, and enjoy football. That is the most important. Ben Davis. <coughs> Yes. Yes. Always is difficult uh, to share a position with Danny Ross, that is uh, one of the best uh, fullback on, on England or in Europe, and uh, he worked very hard uh, to try to find his place. And uh, fantastic professional, fa fantastic uh, boy. Um, Yes, only I, I can praise him because uh, his position wasn't easy from the from the beginning, and and, and he always keep fighting, always uh, waiting uh, his opportunity to to play, and and it's, I think he fully deserved uh, to extend the contract and that improve uh, improving his his salary because. Um, when we are talking about the team, about the squad, this type of player deserves uh, uh, all the credit to uh, to keep uh, fighting uh, and and the level of the of the squad, pushing the level of the squad. And just give us an update on, on Danny Rose. Where, where, where is he in his comeback? Well, I think the the club uh, gave you the information about him about uh, Eric Lamela too. Um, Yes, uh, we'll see. We'll see. Uh, I cannot uh, give um, the date, but we are happy. He's doing well. He's recovery. We'll see. Now uh, it's one week, and then we have the international break, uh, and we'll see if in, in two, three weeks can be available for a stay with the group and training, and then we'll see which is the best moment for him. Uh, start to compete again. Do you have any injury concerns for this weekend? Uh, no, no, no. Only Lamela and, and Dani. Uh, Millwall in the, uh, in the FA Cup. Uh, they've beaten Leicester, beaten Watford, beaten 
Bournemouth, Bournemouth, Watford, Leicester, yes. How wary do you need to be? Uh, we are very focused because uh, <coughs> the game will be very tough. Uh, it's another uh, London derby. And uh, we were watching all the game. Uh, and they fully deserve to be on quarter final. They were better than the Premier League team. I think we are uh, aware about that situation. We need to. We respect them. We respect them. They uh, is a very compact team. Uh, very clear how they play. Um, very clear in the idea that they how they manage the games. Uh, they uh, how they. The formation is one four four two uh, with two striker. Um, we are uh, fully aware how they play, and um, uh, we will. Uh, we know that we will find a very tough game um, because the FA Cup is 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 is, is, is special. Uh, it's magic, and the beauty of the FA Cup is the level is not important because uh, all believe that can can win. And, uh, and for us, it's very important because it's massive to, to be on Wembley semi-final. Very important opportunity for us to go and to play the semi-final. But we know very well that first of all, we need to play again a very tough uh, and very difficult team. There's a proposal for next season, for January next season, to introduce video help for, for referees. Is, is that something in the FA Cup? Is that something that, that you see as inevitable? I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how he affects the game and uh, the timing and all. It's, it's true that it will be important to, to see in a different competition in the FA Cup and, 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 and then uh, find all the information and how he, he can work no, in football. But this is, I think. For the referee, it will be good, and I think for us too. But and then is uh, how how working, uh, and how is affect the the game. And so that is important. First of all, to to test that that uh, things. Finally, I want to ask you about um, pre-match music in the dressing room. Um, pre-match music. Yeah. Do you, do you think it's important? Do you think it matters? <coughs> Yes, uh, I love to hear music, listen to music before the the game. I think today in all changing room happen. In our changing room is uh, Dele Ali, is Harry Kane, sometimes is the goalkeeper coach Tony Jimenez with some Spanish music that was is very boring for for our player. And uh, yes, but no, I I I like I like in a moment that they are uh, preparing for the save. I think it's important to uh, to be focused, and the music help them to be focused on the game. And, and it's true that half an hour before uh, we stop the music, that is when we arrive, uh, one hour and a half before uh, start the, or yes, 45 minutes before the start, because we start the pre act on the changing room. Uh, in that moment, we stop, silence. That is the better, the best music. Is the silence and um, and then focus on the on the game. But I like I like from the from the moment that we arrive to the changing room. It's the final ever FA Cup match at White Hart Lane uh, this weekend. Maybe. <laughs> is there anything special planned? No, no special plan. I think uh, we will f uh, follow the same plan that before. Uh, and uh, no, 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 no special plan. No, no special plan. For our side, no. I don't know if the club is thinking to do something special, but for our for our uh, sporting sports side, uh, we will follow the same the same way that before. It will feel special potentially to the fans, though, and something that they're going to, to cherish. They'll want to end there on a high. No, nothing is. Uh, I think we are focusing to play and try to win the game. Uh, and on the end of the game, if we will win, maybe 
um, with the possibility that no play anymore in the FA Cup, and maybe uh, we'll see what happens. But um, uh, today we are not preparing nothing special to do before to play. Yes. I don't know. I don't know. We hope yes, and we wish that uh, can be close of Alan Shearer. Alan Shearer was one of the best striker, unbelievable player, and um, and why why not? He's uh, he's still very young. Harry Kane uh, potential to improve a lot, and why not one day? But we are talking about Alan Shearer that uh, with Gary Lineker or. Uh, player uh, that were fantastic, unbelievable player, no? Um, in terms of yourself and trophies, you know, you could be the first manager to bring a trophy to Spurs since 2008. Do you think this competition is your best chance at that? It's, a, it's one chance. I don't know if it's the best chance, but this uh, is a one chance that uh, good opportunity for us. It's one opportunity for us to 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 win some trophy. It's true that we are involved in two competitions, Premier League, that will be tough to win because the, the gap is 10 points against Chelsea. And the FA Cup is a possibility that we have uh, in front of us and, and it's, it's up to us, of course. Yes, of course. They they are in a very good run and, and full confidence, trust in the way that they play. Yes, will be tough. Um, and then it's the FA Cup, the beauty of the FA Cup that you you believe always that you can win. Uh, it's not important the level that you are playing in League One or in Premier League. And uh, for us, it's uh, it's a final. Uh, we are ready to fight. Will be tough. Um, and uh, it's a massive, massive uh, thing for us. Uh, the challenge to play on on Wembley semi-final, FA Cup semi-final, is a is a is a ma massive challenge for us. Uh, you say it's, it's like the final, so you're going to be putting your strongest possible team out. Of course, like like always, I think that we will pick the best team to try to to win. Uh, the good thing that we only Lamela and Danny Ross uh, uh, they they are insured, but um, and after and then is all the squad, um, all the player available for to be select. Yes, Dave, do you want any questions? Um, Chris, there's quite a lot of crowd problems at the Leicester Villa game last time. Yeah. Yes, yeah, for me it's the first time that we I face to to Millwall. I hear a lot of things, but um, I I um, I hope and um, I wait that all happen uh, in a very good way. Um, it's a game, important game for, for both uh, club, but I hope that nothing happen. Um, I I I, uh, I trust that uh, our fans and their fans they behave well, and uh, but that is my my wish because it's football. Football is to, to try to to enjoy, and and and, and happiness and uh, no sense to to fight for for uh, nothing. No, but um, in my in my head is try to provide and to be calm and and try to. To show uh, about football, and, and but this that is my is my is my wish, no. And, and most of the press talk this week has been about Arsenal Wenger's position at Arsenal. How sympathetic are you to the um, publicity that Arsenal has been that Arsenal has been receiving? Is it possible for a Tottenham manager to be sympathetic to an Arsenal manager? Uh, I don't understand your question. If I am.
No, sorry, it's, no, it's, uh, it's not about me. It's about the fan, sorry, the fans and <laughs> the club. Is is my colleague. Uh, Do you feel sorry for him though? It's football, eh? I know the business, and I I, I never expect from my colleagues that feel sorry for me if one day. Uh, I will be in the same position than another college. That is business. Feel sorry or not feel sorry. I think uh, it's not important my feeling or my emotion. <laughs> you know, I have uh, full respect to him. I admire him like a manager. And after 20 years, manage uh, Arsenal. But only I can see what happened in another club. My opinion is not important. My feelings is not, are not important. My emotions are not important. I have a lot to do here to try to, to care about my club, my fans, uh, my player, look after myself. <laughs> we are in a position always, a very difficult position because, uh, you know, to be a coach or be a manager is, is not an easy task. Yes, of course. They are ready. We are ready. We are ready to fight. We are aware of about what happened in the previous uh, tie. Uh, will be tough. And the example was a uh, Wickham at home. That was tough for us. Um, it's a good experience. Was was a very good experience for us. And um, yes, uh, Sunday will be a very tough game, and, and we need to give our best. No, 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 because they know, they know that uh, we will find uh, Sunday and um, uh, we are very aware. Uh, you don't need to explain because I think quarter final, the possibility to go to the semi final. Uh, and you know that first of all, from the, from the first moment, you, you must to be fight, you must uh, play, you must to run, you must to to be focused and concentrate and try to win. Uh, in front will be a, a very tough uh, opposition. Uh, <laughs> full confidence, uh, trust in, in the way that they play and, and, and believe. And uh, we need to be motivated and exciting to play and in front of our fans and our hard lane. And then the objective is to, to be on, on Wembley on the semi-final. It's not clear on the explanation. No, it's yes. Hip injury. Hip injury. So just a hip injury, it's not a, not a family issue anymore? No, 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 no. And how close is he to, to coming back? Do you think maybe a week or two weeks? Or? I don't want to lie to you. I don't want to give some information that after you use, you are right to use, but I cannot say one week, two weeks, three weeks, one month, or maybe next season. I, I don't know. It's, it's too difficult, my position, because... Uh, we are assessing, uh, assess, uh, assessing, assessing him, assessing him every day. How he is every day. On the morning, we prepare some plan to to do. Sometimes, he's involved from the beginning on the warm up with the team, and uh, sometimes uh, he feel pain, and we change the plan. And now it's day by day, day by day. We'll see. We hope that uh, as soon as possible can be available again because uh, it's, that is our. Uh, idea, but we cannot give uh, more information that uh, I can provide now. He's now taking all his treatments here, not in, not in here. Here, 100% here. He's, he's uh, doing everything here. Okay, Tom, last one. That was yours. Okay, lovely. Cameras off, please. Thank you.